Asalaamu As Alaikum to all my veiled beauties. So today I've got this succulent recipe which I know you guys are going to love. This is actually uh, my sister's recipe, well the chicken part is. Um, it's Thai green chicken and this is prawn stir fry and I've just got some plain rice there. Seriously, you guys have to try this out. Links are below for my sister's channel. Okay, so let's go over the ingredients first. So for the mushroom stir fry, we're going to need this all-in-one mushroom stir fry pack. We also need some sweet and sour sauce. And this is in a jar and you can just dash this into your stir fry. Some king prawns, obviously, and uh, some peppers. And you can just um, use assorted peppers, red peppers, whatever you fancy. Um, we'll also need for the recipe some sweet chilli sauce, some liam perins. Um, we'll also need some soy sauce, that's soy sauce in there some garlic, onions we're going to start on our stir fry and the first thing I like to do is cut up my veg and here I'm cutting up my red peppers using the julienne cut way so that's, I'm just going to be cutting it into long strips like so just leave your peppers in a bowl and we'll get started on to the next step so in a non-stick cooking pan just pour in one tablespoon of vegetable or olive oil Next, add in dry red chilies to the oil, and this just flavors the oil. Add in your chopped garlic and fry together. After frying the garlic and the chilies for a couple of minutes, we're just going to add in the king prawns. And we just want to sort of semi cook the prawn, not cook it all the way through. This, the garlic will just um, inco be incorporated into the prawn and give it a rich flavor. We're also going to season our prawns with salt and black pepper of course and mix well. So now that we've um, semi-cooked our prawns, we're just going to set it aside and, um, and then use it later for our stir fry. To the same frying pan where you cook the prawns, add in some spring onions and some garlic. Add about half of your stir fry. Next, add in your sweet and sour stir fry sauce to the vegetables, like so. Season with half a teaspoon of salt. Sprinkle some ground black pepper, I'd say about half to one teaspoon, depending on your liking. Drizzle a tablespoon of your sweet chilli sauce. About two teaspoons of your soy sauce. Lightly drizzle your liam perins. This is optional but I included some tomato sauce because it brings a richness. So now include your star ingredient, um, the prawns, and uh, make sure you mix it into the stir fry really well and um, yeah, cook it through. This part is optional but I like my uh, king prawn stir fry really juicy, succulent and saucy. So I actually um, have included a few more of the sauces, so the sweet chilli, um, soy sauce and I've just seasoned it a little bit more with a pinch of pepper. But again this is optional, you don't have to include this if you don't like yours too overpoweringly saucy. So I've just pre-cooked my sliced peppers. Um, in butter just I wanted this dish to be really rich but you can just add in the pepper straight into the stir fry or you can just use olive oil if you want to pre-cook it beforehand but the butter just brings out that richness of the taste and the richness of that red color so that's how you make the king prawn stir fry. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. It's a gorgeous meal. It would be perfect for your iftar or just for your average dinner. And um, the chicken part of the recipe will come in my next video. So watch this space for that. Catch you next time in my next video. Asalaamu As